And a new chapter is beginning now for a little girl in Pennsylvania. Ten-year-old Sarah Marnahan is getting a new set of lungs. After a controversy that involved a local judge and lawmakers in Washington, D.C., Marley Hall has the latest now from Philadelphia. Janet Murnahan is thrilled her daughter Sarah is getting a lung transplant today. Really, I think it's a blessing from God. The 10 year old suffers from severe cystic fibrosis. Doctors recently told her family Sarah has just weeks to live. Her mother posted on Facebook today is the start of Sarah's new beginning and new life. Sarah's transplant comes just days after a federal judge granted her family's request to suspend a rule that blocked her from being put on a waiting list for an adult lung, which are far more available. Sarah is receiving an adult set of lungs, so the size is being adjusted to fit her. We would not have had, you know, access to these lungs. They would have been offered to hundreds of people first and they're, you know, in excellent condition and uh, they would never have come down to Sarah. Health officials say the main reason for the rule is a shortage of lungs to be donated. They also say children are less likely than older patients to die while waiting for a transplant. It was a hard thing to have the courage to sort of come out and, and put us in the spotlight and put Sarah in the spotlight, but I felt like it's what I needed to do to save her. Sarah was one of more than 1,700 other Americans waiting for lung transplants, including about 30 kids her age. 11 year old Javier Acosta suffers from the same genetic disorder as Sarah. He's in the same hospital, hoping he'll soon get a transplant. Marley Hall for CBS News, Philadelphia. Now, doctors just completed that transplant. They released a statement just a few minutes ago saying it was a success. The estimate, uh, they estimated that transplant could add six or seven years to Sarah's life.